sea somewhere waiting for me my lover stands on golden sands and watches the ship that goes Hi, my name is Ella Jones. I'm 14 years old and I'm a dancer at CC and Company Dance Complex here in Raleigh, North Carolina. It's my home and I love everyone there. The environment is so safe and it makes me just feel loved and like warm. It's just a great place for me. I dance about 14 hours a week in technique and then that's not including the weekends. So on the weekends it mostly depends, sometimes I get weekends off and that's great because I get to hang out and find balance with my school friends which is also why I cheer. Um, and those two things really differ in my life because I love cheer but dance is like my thing, it's my like passion. Um, as in talent and natural ability, um, I think that for the most part everyone is teachable. Um, some people are obviously born with natural talent. Um, a lot of the people that I teach though, the ones who have more natural ability like within their body, Coincidentally, I don't know why, um, but those are oftentimes, not always, but oftentimes the people who then they have other weaknesses such as like connecting um, or performing or taking risk, etc. Um, so it's kind of fun though because they still have something to work on and vice versa. A lot of the people who have this natural fire and fight they're not always the most technical dancers, so, and on the other end, that's what I get to teach them. Um, so yeah, every, I, I think everyone, if you want it, is teachable in some way, shape, or form. This is my little brother, Walt. He's seven, right? What grade are you in? First. He's in first grade, and he's loving his school at the moment. Yeah. He loves to read too. Don't you love to read? Yes? I guess he says hello. So, are you funny? I told him that you were funny and witty. Can you speak, please? My sister, she dances good. Her hair, her hair never looks good when she dances, but, but, our dog, um, 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 loves her mom, and then she loves Ella the most. I signed Ella up for dance when she was about two and a half. Um, she just kind of needed a little activity. She might've been closer to three, actually, now I think, of it. I think it was closer to her third birthday. We put her in that. She was always a really prissy child and I knew that dance would be something she'd want to try. Um, of course, first day of class, loved it. Um, and the rest is pretty much history. Um, at a very young age, wanted to be in theater. She wanted to do, I took her to a play, the Mary Poppins on Broadway, and she wanted to, she kept telling me she wanted to be on stage and be in a play. I went through a couple friends to find these opportunities and one connected me with a lady named Terry Dollar who was an agent in town just kind of by luck. Ella got, well I shouldn't say by luck, I guess she was the she was the part they were looking for but we, um, it's kind of like what are the odds? When, I feel like you get things when you least expect them but she was cast in a major movie called The Disappointments Room alongside Kate Beckinsale. So that was a really cool experience. She had to wear a prosthetic and she played the ghost in the movie.
Ella's a very driven person. Um, I see it in all aspects of her life, from her schoolwork especially, first and foremost, because without her academics, in my opinion, um, she wouldn't have the time to spend on dance. Um, but she really is a, a very focused uh, individual. Um, you know, and, and her mother and I have always preached school first um, and academics first. Um, but I think that carries over into her dance life, and I think that discipline that she has in in the classroom, you know, you know, carries over to the studio. When Ella dances, Ella is a complete person. Um, I've always supported her in her in her dance, um, as I have in, in everything that she's wanted to do. Um, but I really see a, a, a drive there in that direction. <laughs> I can show you Jules if you want. She's sure, I am. This is my dog, Jules. <laughs> She's not being very still right now. Um, I love her so much. She was a surprise around the time of my birthday. We worked really hard for her. Um, we love her so much, and she's literally the sweetest puppy ever. Got it. Because I think it's because I'm tired. Yeah. Did you nap? No, I did all my homework, so I wouldn't have to do it tonight. Oh, uh, okay. well, that's smart. This, we got a little, like, we saved it but it could have gone around. Oh, first started working with Ella, um, she's definitely a kid who has natural um, fight and fire, um, and she has a very natural facility, she has length, um, so that has been there, um, but she was really young too, so it's especially as she has gotten older, it's how can we take that further, how can we um, enhance that and make that even better, obviously. I think the thing that she struggled with the most um, was taking risk and like connecting emotionally, and so that has definitely come extremely far. Um, and she's, um, I think just with age anyway, for most dancers, if not all, that obviously brings a different maturity and changes your movement. So that's kind of where we're at right now with her. Um, and that's really exciting to see and be part of that development. Um, yeah, that was the main stuff. Yeah. Okay, we have time to do it again. <laughs> Do you need water? Um, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Guess. Get a little sip.